So a few days ago, we got a brand new look at Season 5 of Camp Cretaceous. The clip itself was very brief, and they left these details for everybody to examine. It was not supposed to be very clear. They obviously don't want to spoil too much. However, after watching this, I think there are two very clear storylines taking place. On one hand, you have Manticorp and the main characters, and they are on the same island as they were back in Season 4. That is where we see the robots, the dinosaurs like the Spinosaurus, Carnotaurus, and Baryonyx, and of course that same Tyrannosaurus Rex we saw before. Then on the other hand, we have another storyline taking place. This, in my opinion, takes place on Site A, and the reason for this is somewhat simple. On the screen, as we saw, there were many different slogans, and one of them was a very clear reference to Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. But as we know, the timeline here is well before Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom takes place. They obviously showed the opening scene, but if I did have to guess, that might be the only time the film and the TV series connect. So in my opinion, the connection to Fallen Kingdom is this. During the lead-up to Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom itself, we know about the Dinosaur Protection Group. After the events of Jurassic World, they gave us lots of details about the island. And just to name a few details, people now had access to dinosaur cloning technology, they were traveling to the island, and in regards to these groups, these animals were not considered to be safe. So what I'm saying here is this, I think for the storyline on Site A in Season 5, these details we got before Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom will play out. We will see groups go to the island, and according to the clip, I do believe one of those is Biosyn. And as many of you know, I'm talking about the Barbasol can. This is a clear reference and foreshadow to Biosyn. And also as we saw in this clip, one of the slogans was this, The wait is over. And of course you can speculate about what that means, but in light of what we saw with the Barbasol can, I think that has to do with Biosyn. After all this time waiting, we finally see Biosyn get introduced. And I do believe for the person holding this can, it would make the most sense for them to be working for Biosyn. This would then lead to a different storyline, and it could possibly end there. That would give us a backstory of Biosyn before Jurassic World Dominion. Obviously the season takes place after Jurassic World Dominion, but this will still tell us quite a bit. In that Dinosaur Protection Group article, one of the groups being talked about was Biosyn, and realizing that would be very interesting. That would be very unique, and it ties in all these details we got before Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. For all of you though, what do you think about this? Write all of your answers on this topic down below, and if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, and have a nice day.